Hey gang, we're gonna be watching a uh, Darman copycats today, so uh, buckle your seatbelts because it's gonna be a fun ride. Uh, if you know Darman, uh, well, your mom does and everyone else does because you're living under a rock if you don't. You've been on YouTube, you know who he is. I'm not really gonna try to explain him, but because uh, uh, I'm lazy. You got it. You'll get it. You'll know what it is. You'll f you'll figure it out. You'll figure it out. And if you don't, surprise. We're gonna be watching Samir Bhavnani's younger brother. <laughs> Bad joke. Life lessons with Lewis. It's like an inspiration, uh, type channel with really cheesy acting. I guess. Not I guess. No, it's really cheesy acting. Really shit. Bad act. Sorry to the actors. We're not going to be racking the Darman, because that's that's too that's too baseline, too cringe. Do y'all hear that? Do y'all hear that? I guess I just gotta wait till it's over. All right, I think it's good now. I think we're all. Yeah, dude, I would be—I would look so stupid if you guys cannot hear any of this. We're gonna watch Life Lessons with Lewis rendition of Darman, and it's kind of similar to his friend Samir. Um, and Samir Bhavnani, he makes them, but they're ableist. Paint the picture, you'll get it. You know, every a lot of ist. Throw some phobics in there too, maybe. I don't know, I don't religiously watch his channel. Um, but because I, I, I honestly don't understand how he has that many views. I don't get it. How did how do that many Facebook moms just sit there and just just on loop? Why? Why? Please, please, your your son is shouting slurs at me on the Xbox. Get him off! What are you doing? Oh my god, we're just gonna we're just gonna get into it. We're just gonna get into it. We're just gonna watch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going dressed like that? Dad, I told you. I'm going out on a date tonight. You never told me nothing about no date. Now go back upstairs and put some clothes on. Your dad's just messing with you, sweetie. Did you see your face? <laughs> S-tier acting. Like, almost porn acting. I swear to God. I'm not going to like this. I'm not going to like this. You're going, huh? You all have to mess with me like that. Baby, you know I love you. It's just my way of showing affection. So who's this guy you're going on a date with tonight? Damn, that's your way of showing affection? Fuck, that sucks. God damn, you'll never know when this man is fucking joking. <laughs> What's his name? His name is Tyson. He's on a basketball team. Ooh, tall, dark, and handsome. Well, he's not an actor. Yeah, this is the same kid that was in all those honor classes with you, huh? Yeah, same guy. Mm. Well, I'll be nice to the kid, but I still think you're too young to be dating if you ask me. What is this, friends? Why is there so much space in between their lines? Look, I know they're hired off a of Craigslist or something, and I can't be that harsh because, you know, money is money. But I will be harsh because of the things that they say later in the video. High school. You didn't think that we were too young, now did you? Dad, I'll be 18 in two weeks. You're just gonna have to trust that you raised me right. And... I wouldn't bring someone home unless I knew they were special. This is my first boyfriend. Please don't embarrass me. So when do we get to meet him? Yeah, he looks very pleased to meet the guy. <laughs> I wonder when he's going to come in. Maybe maybe like any second. Here now. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is a porno. Why is there so much sexual tension, or lack thereof, between these two parents? Like, I know their romantic interest, obviously. They're, they're the parents of the child. She's right there. You're being gross. Dad, this is Tyson. Tyson, these are our parents. Mr. Smith, Mrs. Smith, it's, it's nice to meet you guys. Um, it's nice. <laughs> I love how she's completely dumbfounded, like, You've seen a white person. I can guarantee you, most black people in America have seen a white person. It's inescapable. Like, I know it's like this thing where, like, uh, some black people don't like 
people dating outside the race. And yes, this that is an actual issue that does need to be talked about. I have a feeling that this isn't gonna isn't gonna talk about that in the way you think it is. Just a hunch. And also like <laughs> Tyson. I'm sorry. I, I went so long without making fun of the name, but Tyson, the chicken, the chicken. All right. They did that on purpose because there's no seasoning on that bit. None. They did. They did you wrong, Tyson. They did you wrong. Wait, I, I, is that the only name we got? I wasn't really paying attention that much. Let me let me double check here. Nice to meet you, also, Tyson. I'm Ebony's mother, Alicia. They named her Ebony. Might as well just name her Black and Spanish. How on the nose are you gonna be? I got grease on my hands. Grease on your hands from what? You're in the kitchen. I love script writing. Script writing such you, it's a good passion of yours, Lewis. You want to talk about it more, Lewis? Look, I don't care if that's me. That's all I had to say. <laughs> you thought I had more commentary to that because I'm a commentary channel? Get the fuck out of here. Uh, yes, sir. After my uh, late grandfather. Well, it's nice to meet you, Tyson. Will you guys be staying for dinner or do you have other plans? Oh, well, actually, we have some reservations to go eat, but maybe next time. I bet you those reservations are at the whitest place you can imagine. Like, let, let's see. Let's see. Let's think of some. Let's think of some together. Come on. Interactive. Comment. Comment. Yeah, subscribe. What's what's pretty white? Ah, White Castle. Obviously. I don't know. Jack in the Box just sounds white. Who cares? <laughs> Excuse me. That was my cool ringtone. Don't mind it. <laughs> Fucking read him and weep, bitch. Oh. I hit that though. <laughs> so what kind of foods are going out to eat tonight? Hmm? Hamburger? Hot dogs? Spaghetti o <laughs> He literally did the fucking thing I was talking about. Like, let's think of some white ass food. Was that supposed to be like come off racist? It was. That was the thing that he's trying to do and trying to portray in this, by the way. That was reverse racism, guys. Hamburgers? Hot dogs, spaghettios. <laughs> Sorry, no white person's gonna be fucking offended by that, cause it's not, it's not even, it's not even mean. It's just, it, that's a, that's a weak insult. I would be, I would be laughing at that insult. No, I do love hot dogs though. Yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> the shoulder check by the wife is is top tier i love it keep doing it subtlety is not a thing subtlety doesn't exist in in, in uh lewis's world you got plans for my daughter tonight uh just dinner for now i know she has to be home by nine so uh, we're just grabbing some food yeah that better be the only thing you're grabbing tonight because i know how you white folks like to conquer everything you get your hands on Dad. Base, dude, I, dude, that's so base, and I love, dude, the shoulder check. Oh, I started like XQC. I said, dude, a lot right there. Dude, he looks, dude, dude, that's, dude, dude, dude. Oh, I had temporarily, dude, 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 dude. When I was young, dude. Oh, the kid, fuck you, dude. But the shoulder check again, man, <laughs> you're gonna knock him over. Uh, yeah, I, I don't really know what you mean by that, sir. But we're we're literally just getting some food. <laughs> Even the white guys like, yeah, that's not, that's not even racist. What are you talking about, sir? You know, for one, for one, Tyson, for your name, I'm only reason I'm against you is because your name is Tyson. But for this one time, I'm on your side. So, <clears throat> you're on the basketball team. <laughs> David was on the basketball team also in high school. He has a record for the most points in a game. 54. Well, actually, Mom, Tyson just beat that record in his last game. He scored 62 points. Shoot a lot of threes, so. <laughs> you just gonna stick to your own sport, huh? Huh? Hmm? Huh? What do you mean by that? I was just, I was about to congratulate Tyson, and then you, you say that. I thought this was the, the black guy doing reverse racism towards, towards the white guy. Hmm, this is turning into something different that I totally didn't expect. Uh, wha what do you mean by that? Sir, water polo, golf, you just can stick to your own sport, huh? 
You just had to come take our sport away from us too. Does he know that like Tiger Woods like exists? One of the most popular golfers and the only golfer I know. And also, again, stick to your own sport. I, I wonder w what he's referring to. Stick to your own sport. What does what do he mean, mean by? Oh yeah, you guys remember who wrote this again? It's Lewis. It's Lewis, guys. Lewis wrote that. And just to assure you, he's white. That, that's it. You're being extremely rude to Tyson right now. Apologize to him. No, no. Uh, don't you mean reverse racist to him? You're being very Uno. Revert. I, I, that was no. Scrap. Scrap that joke. Scrap that. Scrap that. Move on. Let's continue. It's okay. Your dad has the right to ask him questions. He, he just wants to know who's taking his daughter out tonight. That's all. Hey, I would be just as worried as the dad here. I don't want my imaginary daughter dating a Skate Three preset character. They don't even speak. Right, honey. Take Ebony upstairs. Put a sweater over that dress. Wanna have a talk with Tyson? My type? Sir, I think you have me confused. Look, I, I can't comment on how you grew up, what kind of experiences you might have went through in life. I was only born in 2003. You notice that he said, hmm, maybe Tyson's a little sus. Maybe, maybe he is, because he just said, well, I was only born in 2003, and racism didn't exist back then. Things are different now. <laughs> The, that's the vibe that it gave off. Is that I really, really like your daughter, and I will be nothing but kind and respectful to her. Yeah, you say that now, until you two break up, and then you're gonna shoot the whole damn school up. Hey, man. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing at that. I shouldn't. <laughs> it's the joke itself isn't funny, okay? It caught me so off guard, and the fact that that's the only thing that th that Lewis can think of in his writing that's like slightly offensive, I guess. That most most of the time, <laughs> school school shooters are white, but it's not because they fucking broke up with their girlfriend, dude. Okay. Can you come over here now? Have her home by 9 p.m. sharp, but that's your ass. What is your problem? My problem? You just didn't see our daughter bring home that white boy. I don't care about the color of his skin. You don't talk to people like that. It's rude. And frankly, you're just sounding a little racist yourself. Hey, he said, no black woman ever. What? You were on track with like, oh, you're being rude. Yeah, you could say he's being rude. See, this is what I mean by these Craigslist actors. They say this. I know it's for the money, but like, come on, man. Don't stoop this low. <laughs> yeah, man, that was really racist when you said the SpaghettiOs thing. That's a stereotype. What's next? White people can't dance. Honey, he's white. What does that have to do with anything? I mean, I must admit, when he walked through the door, I was a bit shocked. Right. A bit? You were fucking jaw dropped. What are you talking? A bit. You said. I shouldn't have made that pose for the camera. Mistakes, mistakes. She's gonna date whomever she wants to date. And as long as- <laughs> I love how he's like a little baby about it. He's like, hm, I can't be reverse racist. <laughs> also like, just just to assure you, I, I don't know if I made it clear. Reverse racism, I, even though this is the entire joke of the video, I. Reverse racism isn't a thing. You can't be racist towards white people. I just wanna I just wanna make that clear. People that are gonna be in my comments, I don't wanna hear it. 
Shut up. You're racist towards white people. You know what? I'm gonna use the same same line that that white people use against me. Well, I have white friends. I have white friends, so I can't be racist. My mom's white. And respectful to her, and treats her like a queen. That's all that matters. Okay? Look, David. This isn't the '60s, okay? And that kid, he has nothing to do what we've been through, nor is it his fault. We. Hey, you got you guys remember who wrote this? You guys, you guys remember who wrote this? It was Lewis. Yeah, dude, it's not the '60s anymore. It, it, it racism just doesn't exist. And also, why are you saying '60s anymore? Like, there, it was against white people. You fucking ah! I hate these. I I know they're just acting. I know they're just acting. I know they're just acting. I'm and then people are gonna comment saying like, so you're saying it's his fault? But if no, but if you uphold those same things that your ancestors did, then yeah, fucker, they're gonna be like, oh, so you think every white person? No, dude. No. <laughs> Fuck. We can't come together as people until we learn from one another. It's 2021. Let's not continue to repeat the same ignorant thinking as the past. Maybe you're right. <laughs> what do you mean the same ignorant thinking? It was ignorant to think that white people, the majority of white people in the 60s were racist? I don't think that's ignorant. I just think that's true. The 60s! <laughs> Obviously, there's still fucking good people there, but like... Th do you know what happened to the fucking 60s? <laughs> Lewis, you're losing me with the script. You're losing me. And it's gonna... Uh, you know what's funny? It's, it, 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 this is only the beginning, boys. <laughs> oh my god. You. Take some time to think about that. While you're sleeping on the couch tonight. Alone. Do, 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 damn, sleeping on the couch alone. <laughs> this summer. <laughs> Reverse racism. <laughs> Where the fuck is he? Why does he look like he's in the fucking void, man? He's where Squidward's at when, from that episode of SpongeBob. Alone, alone. head ass. He really is sleeping on the couch alone. <laughs> It's amazing. I would definitely go. Was he just sitting there thinking about it the entire time? He's like, maybe I should have left out the hamburgers and hot dogs, man. I shouldn't have said the spaghettios. That was a little too far. Ebony, why don't you uh tell Tyson goodnight and let me have a word with him? Okay, I'll see you Monday. You know, there's a thing called cutting. I, I would know. I, I, I have a Adobe uh, certified professional degree. <laughs> Not a flexor anyway. Can't you tell? Look at all this editing. I fucking hate myself. For what the dog do? Way too much work. I don't even know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> hey Tyson, I just wanna apologize about the way I was acting earlier. I just never seen my daughter with another guy before. And it scared me. And the truth is, what really scared me is that she really likes you. We fear what we do not know. You ever heard that expression? I guess I'm just a scared father. That's all. I'd like to learn more about you. My wife and I talked it over and wanted you to come back tomorrow. We're gonna be barbecuing some ribs. Maybe you can come over tomorrow and we can learn some more about you. Yes! Lewis! Fucking perfect monologue. You're so good. Give this man an Oscar. Fuck Leo DiCaprio. Give it to... Give it... Give it! I'll do you one better, sir. How about I cook some food for you guys? <laughs> and make a mean macaroni salad and uh, some tasty hot dogs. Mm. How about we just stick to the Okay, you can bring your hot dogs. <laughs> wow, what a what a what a what a good ending, man. I mean, I would take the ribs, though. I would, I would.
No, you did not just put a Martin Luther King quote. No, you did not. No, you didn't. You thought you did something. You really thought you did something. No. Okay. He put a Martin Luther King quote after he said stick to your own sport in the same video when he was referring to basketball and black people. I'm losing my mind. Music make you lose control. Music make you lose control. What? I hope you guys enjoyed today's life lesson with Luis. Make sure to like and subscribe to this channel so you get notified every time we release a new video. And as always, make sure to share this with someone that you love. Wait, 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 stop. Don't Please, for the love of God, don't give me Alpha M. Okay, we're done with that with that video, uh, but I, it's not over. I, I have another one to show you for contrast, uh, what you say. And now I'm just... Uh, that, that took a lot of energy out of me, especially Alpha M at the end. Jesus, man, get the fuck out of my face. <laughs> Tries to sell you a watch every fucking five seconds. I didn't enjoy that uh, video, Lewis. I didn't. I I'm sure my viewers did, because they like to see me fucking, I don't know, be tortured, I guess. So, thanks for the views. All right, so the next one is going to be the exact same script, only a couple changes. It swapped roles, so now it's going to be actually races yay i can't wait to see what lewis has in store you said late father he passed away uh, unfortunately yes sir he was working in our front yard one morning when all of a sudden he just let me guess drive by shooting oh the first the first couple seconds the first couple seconds that's sick that's so what Hey, remember when uh, the other the other guy said the same line? He didn't say anything about his late father passing away. He didn't say anything. Was that just... Did he just fucking improv that? I mean, he looks like a thumb. I wouldn't doubt it. You're doing a great job at selling it. Great job. What the fuck, man? Are you kidding? Last chance to win the iPhone 12 mini. Details at the end of this video. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you, Lewis. An iPhone? You want an iPhone so you can get off your shitty little fucking Android watching this racist video? <laughs> I'm gonna need an iPhone after this. I'm gonna break mine. Mm -hmm. Whoa, look who got dressed up. Oh my god, honey, you look gorgeous. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> Ooh, don't forget where you got those looks from. Yeah. Hey, hey. Hey, what? Excuse me? Excuse me, moi? Um, pardon? Th this is a straight moment. This is a straight moment. Only straight people would say this shit, man. Only straight people would say this shit about their fucking children, man. But you got your brains from me. You certainly didn't get them from your father. David just messaged me. Oh, dude, fuck. Lewis, get better at editing, goddammit. What the fuck? That was so loud. Come on, you could get someone that has a... Uh, Adobe certified professional degree. I don't know anyone who has that. Mom, Dad, this is David. Mr. Larry, Mrs. Larry, how y'all doing? Wait. His name's David. The dad's name in the last one was David. The prophecy is true. Oh my God, Lewis, you're a genius. You are better than the MC fucking you the DCU, and that's not saying much because the DCU's fucking trash. Don't get your panties in a twist about fucking Superman v. Batman. Shitty movie. Um, hello, David, is it? Yes, ma'am. Named after my late father. It's nice to meet you. David, is it? <laughs> she just said that. She just said that, man. Maybe, maybe... <laughs> Maybe stick to the script. You're improvising a little too much here. Where are you from, Compton? Oh my god. Okay. You guys remember who wrote this again? Such clever writing. I never would have thought of that one. Like, come on, man. Just say the N-word. I'm oh, sorry. My father passed away from a heart attack a few years back. It must have been so tough for you. Yes, it was. But I'm lucky I got to spend the time I did have with him. A lot of my friends growing up didn't even have a father. Well, that's, uh, that's one thing that's wrong with your culture. Uh, get women pregnant and you got a lot of single mothers raising babies. Excuse me, what?
You want to run that one by me again? Hmm? Sorry, flabbergasted. Your racism levels are just... This is the same guy who put the Martin Luther King quote, by the way. I, and I know it's going to have some big message, right? But it kind of defeats the whole message when you have a video doing the, 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 the flip side of that situation, which kind of disproves the other one. Reverse racism isn't a thing. Mic drop, but I'm not doing it because it's expensive, so fucking edit it. Dad, you're being super disrespectful to David right now. Disrespectful is a word for it, I guess, but not the right one. Racist. That's the right one. <laughs> He's well past that line. He went over it. Him saying culture sounds like a slur in itself. Apologize to him. Hey, we're just uh, two guys having a conversation here. Ain't that right, David? Yeah. Yeah, we're just two guys having a conversation, right? I don't dislike uh, black people, colored people, but... I just don't agree with them. That's the that's the take I feel like you would have. And that people do have. Don't think for a second. I'm not on you, bub. Oh, look, he turned to Wolverine. Nice improvising. Again, you're doing a great job of being a white guy. He really pulls it off. It's almost like he really is white. Hey, look, it's the, it's the flip side of this part. Hey, we heard the other one. Let's see how this one's going to turn out. It shouldn't be that bad. My type. <laughs> what, you mean black? You know nothing about me. You watch the news where they take 1% of bad examples out there, and you let them paint a picture of everybody. I'm not a statistic. And you shouldn't be so quick to judge, because I have nothing but the best intentions for your daughter. Talk, David. She's an amazing young lady with a big heart, Fuck which tells yeah, me she would have some amazing parents to raise her. So I'm doing my best to not judge you based off the way you've been treating me tonight. Wait. I'm convincing myself maybe you're just having a bad day. Huh? Tom. What? Hey, whoa, hey, no, wait, pause, motherfucker. You were, you were so close to, to being based, man. So close to second based. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Man, you had a bad day, so that excuses all your racism towards another person. I stepped on dog shit, so I can call someone a slur now. Fuck, man, I didn't know that. You guys remember who wrote this again? I'm having a swell time. How dare you? Excuse you? How dare you treat that young man like that? What are you, racist? <laughs> what are you, racist? No. Where did you get that from? I don't know where you saw that. Racist? I have black friends. Great father, that's all. So he's black. So he's a criminal. Is that what you're saying? Hey, you've seen the news. You know how they behave. <laughs> You're uh, why why is this one have like like a, a more of a major difference in the script here? Hmm, it's almost like there's actually something to talk about on this side. Crazy. Notice how the other one was hot dogs, hamburgers, and spaghettios. And this one is your dad got shot in a drive-by shooting. You're from Compton. And and uh what, what, what was the other one? Let me, let me put my finger on it. Oh, the thing that's wrong with your culture is you get women pregnant and leave. And, and theirs was hot dogs, hamburgers, and SpaghettiOs. No, yeah, it checks out. Seems right. Let's go. Let's continue. Let's continue. Right. You're Italian. And all Italians are in the mafia. And they like gambling. And they cheat on their wives. You know, I remember very clearly my Jewish family painting a picture of you when we first started dating. I doubt it's because he was white. Or Italian. Like, what? But that's the best way to explain it to another white person. Be like, that's like calling every white person racist. <laughs> oh, now I understand. I call. I can't call every black person a criminal. Because that's like calling every white person racist. That's not true. Because they get so fucking defensive when they hear that. Because it's a self-report. If you see a white person get defensive when they hear that, they're self-reporting. What they didn't see was that you were a hardworking, loving, loyal father and good husband. This is 2021. Let's not repeat the same ignorant things from our past hey 
where it actually makes sense this time to actually say that. That's that's crazy. It actually makes sense to say that. But don't act like you you weren't giving him fucking crazy looks when he walked in because he was black. You're not innocent. It's almost like the continuity error is just blaring. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sleep on the couch. Get owned. Fuck you. Who cares? Hey, you guys have fun? Yes. We had a blast. Sarah, why don't you say goodnight to David and uh, let him have a minute with me, please? David. I want to say sorry about it earlier. I don't know what came over me. I never seen my daughter with a guy before, and it scared me. Yeah, but this one should be I'd never seen my daughter with a black guy before, and it scared me. Because if he said that, he would be racist. But notice that Lewis left that part out of the script, and he never like admitted to actually like being racist or anything. Like, there's no way he switched just like that. But you know, that's how those cheesy Darman videos work. It's a miracle. In 24 fucking hours. I'm not gonna nitpick it that much. I'm literally just poking fun at it. But it's it's funny to look at how trying to defeat racism and debunk racism by being racist. Like Lewis, you're you're a great fucking guy. Just kidding. You suck. Your YouTube channel sucks. Like to catch a cheater is fucking boring. Uh, your editing was dog and it still is. Like, thank God we're done with it. We're done. Okay? So I'll see you next time. Next video. Peace. I wish I was a baller. Hey. I wish I was dope. I wish I had shows. I wish I had hoes. I wish I was less broke. The clothes on my back, yeah, they really ain't that tight. I wish I had steak tied of eating this pad tie.